one of my, all of our very, very dear beloved friends, Shamdas. Do you all remember he came here? He came to India. 1973, just after I left. And after I left, he became best friends with Asim Krishna Dasji. He became an initiated devotee in the Pushti Marg. Became a great, even though born in Connecticut, from Jewish parents. His mother was a state senator, very exalted, educated lady. He made his residence in Brindavan, became a great Sanskrit scholar, translated so many literatures from Sanskrit to English, became an incredible singer. He learned Drupada singing, Drupada drumming. He learned classical ragas. In fact, he very much in the, he established kirtan in the whole yoga community of the Western world, more than anyone. And he always taught pure bhakti. He was an incredible personality. And always serving. He just loved to serve. Such an open heart. And he loved all the devotees here so much. He was incredibly connected with all sorts of people all over the world. Some very, very influential. And he would love to speak about his experience at Radha Gopinath Temple. He just saw so much beauty and sweetness in the devotion of everyone here. And in his own life, for all these years, he has a beautiful little home just about 10 second walk from Gopher Dunn Hill, where he spends over half the year for the last 40 years. He either lives in Gokula or Jatipuram. Now, when he goes to the west, he spreads kirtans and and spreads pure bhakti in such an incredible, beautiful way. And love, love to chant, love to speak about Vrindavan and Krishna, and love to serve everyone and anyone. And inspired so many people to love Krishna. But last night, he passed away from this world in a motorcycle accident. He was supposed to be here for our Push Abhi Sheikhs, our festival this year. He was planning to be here for three days with us, just next week. In fact, this week, he was supposed to come this week. So this is a great, great loss to the hearts of thousands and thousands of people. Great loss to my heart. And <clears throat> his devotion, his faith, his seva, we know for sure that his immortal soul, which is so beloved by Sri Radharani, Srinathji. Every day, practically, he spent hours doing his puja for his Srinathji deity. 
wherever he was in the world. He would put everything aside, spend a few hours cooking for them, bathing them, serving them so beautifully, and chanting the holy names. So let us offer a heartfelt prayer to Sri Sri Radha Gopinath. Offering our sincerest gratitude for the association they gave us with Shamdas Ji Prabhu. And a sincere prayer, a sincere prayer for Sri Sri Radha Gopinath Srinathji to bless his immortal soul. With their desire to uplift his soul to the spiritual world, Goloka. Let us pray for all blessings upon him. And let us offer our gratitude for all he's done for, for us in the world. <clears throat>